Good morning, everyone. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Lordstown Motors. As you can see, the facility, we're just at the entrance of it. It's 6.2 million square feet. You're starting to see how big the area is. Uh, this area over here. Uh, first off, we're gonna be assembling the truck here, but not just that. We'll be building the batteries and the motors here on site. So that's gonna happen all over in this area. We're gonna remove this old system and bring in new technology for the battery system and for the motors. The battery cells, we're negotiating with uh, a, a couple of companies right now. However, that's the only part that's gonna be really produced outside. The battery pack itself will be produced, the modules, the cells, everything will be put together here. The Ohio State motto is, with God, all things are possible. And uh, we think we're going to do the impossible here, right? We think we're going to not just, you know, make a few vehicles here. We're trying to change, change the whole kind of region over to electric. This area over here, this is general assembly. It's the area that um, I'll be leading. Uh, this is the skillet line. We'll be assembling the truck on this line. Um, this is the doors off conveyor. We take the doors off the truck in order to get access inside. Then the doors meet the truck at the end of this line. So the body actually comes from paint on a lift over on the corner over here and comes down this line just as a painted body. We'll be installing all the carpet, seats, windows, uh, instrument panels, the interior, exterior of the vehicle, all right here. There's thousands of robots asleep back there, right, that are going to wake up and, and start making this truck. There's, we have more stamping presses than Tesla has, right? We have some ex-Tesla folks here, right? Um, some of our team, for the team, we've, we've been able to attract the best. And they're moving to Lordstown. So we get people from Volkswagen and Ford and GM and Toyota and Hyundai, right? And Tesla. And we've been able to attract them. And I think they're attractive because, A, everybody wants to be part of something like this. If you're in the automotive business, it's very rare to come out with a first of something. So a lot of people are attracted to that. But also, we have enough meat on the bone where people can start to believe, especially production folks. And a lot of that meat on the bone is this factory, right? This is, for those of you from this area, it, it's such a gem. One thing General Motors has done, they did a really good job of shutting down the factory. Uh, we're starting equipment up, getting it rolling, just getting it moving again. It's been off for a year. This equipment likes to run. So just like, um, you know, somebody laying around for a while, you know, the joints get a little sore and you got, you got to get moving around a little bit. So we're getting, uh, getting these things getting ready to walk. This thing is still warm for when it made its last Chevy Cruze. The agreement that we had with GM to keep it intact, because if we had to retool it, typically these type of things are just gutted, right? And you just get a shell of a building. But they kept it intact. And that was, that was the, it took a year to work that, that deal. But it was the only way we could get to market quickly and at a price point that we could afford. If you see these carts that are on, on here, those are kitted up. What kidding is, is you put parts in there so you don't have to leave the line to grab part. Every time somebody has to walk away from the line, that's inefficiencies in the system. We have begin starting up equipment and getting it running. Uh, retooling will begin, uh, I believe, uh, end of next month was what our schedule is right now. Start to finish, we're going to be kicking a vehicle off the line, off this line, one every vehicle every five minutes. 717 Credit Union business services designed to meet your daily needs. Commercial loans, business deposits, merchant and payroll services. 717 Credit Union, it's knowing you were treated right every time. 